I was terrified. Um, it was a huge private school. I was the first female in the role. I was very young. And it was like, what are wow. people going to think of this oh. person speaking, speaking up about this? I am Reverend Katie O'Dunn, and I always say Reverend because I want folks to know that individuals with OCD can, in fact, be ordained ministers. And I really work at the intersection of faith and OCD. Um, I'm a faith leader who also happens to have OCD. So I worked as a school chaplain with students from all different faith backgrounds for a long time, but also a lot of work around inclusion, um, was really passionate particularly about creating a safe space for my LGBTQ plus students. And um, as a chaplain, since so many of them, unfortunately, where I'm from in Georgia, did not necessarily have that safe space in their faith communities. So many folks, in addition to scrupulosity, might be navigating religious trauma or adverse religious experiences. We were talking about um, tolerance, and it was actually one of my LGBT students looked at me and was like, Chaplain K., I do not want anybody to tolerate me. That's dumb. I want people to love, affirm, accept, and understand me for every aspect of my identity. And I think this intersection of, of faith and OCD, it is so, so, so important for the LGBTQ plus community to really feel that love, to be told and know that they are in fact created in the image of God.